Hello everybody, this is Matej from Consensus Lab and uh, I will be talking about crash failures in the MIR ordering system. So first a little refresher, last time I was talking about MIR BFT which was a framework for implementing distributed protocols in general and that is modular and flexible and uh, especially good for consensus protocols that was uh, available in Hyperledger Labs and uh, it was part of the Consensus Lab Y3 project about scalable consensus protocols. Now this, uh, the name and the location was supposed to change so now that actually happened and uh, MIR BFT is becoming MIR, it already became MIR and is also hosted on the Filecoin GitHub project. So I encourage everybody to go check it out. So today I will be showing a demo about how it survives node crashes. I will be demonstrating it on two examples. One is the little demo chat application that I was also presenting last time as a, as a tool for basically demonstrating how Mir can be used concretely. And uh, then I'll show how a Yuriko Filecoin client can also be crashed and uh, the others still continuing to work with Mir as the ordering layer. So let's have a look. Mm, here we have four nodes. Each one will be running a chat application. Let me just restart it. Dennis was so nice to write a little script that starts four independent processes, each one running a node with a different ID with MIR as uh, the consensus protocol. And uh, as we can see, they start up, everybody has a different ID, they initialize and basically now, for example, node zero uh, writes a chat message, hello, everybody receives the message. If I have a message that everybody sends, for example, I say, everybody says hi, and now I'm typing in all the four terminals at the same time. I submit that, and then everybody will receive the very same sequence of messages that are concurrently submitted, but uh, delivered in, uh, in the total order. So I, ca I can do that again, but now let's see what happens uh, when one node crashes. So for example, node zero, I just kill it, and we can immediately see on the other terminals that uh, the connection was terminated and I on purpose left some debug messages displayed so we see what's happening. Here we see that there's view changes happening because uh, the ordering protocol is now based on PBFT and whenever the node zero is supposed to propose something the other nodes would enter a view change protocol and uh, make sure to elect another leader to do the proposing instead. So we see many view changes because node zero is still dead and it's supposed to be constantly proposing something which it is not. So uh, now one node is dead, but I can still send a message. You can see that it, I failed to send it to node zero, but I still sent it. And uh, now it takes slightly longer because there's some view change, view change timeouts involved, but uh, the message will be delivered. I can also do it concurrently in all the nodes at the same time. I write a hello message. Everybody tries to send it to node zero, they fail, but everybody delivers it. So this was the chat application. And now let's look at Yuriko. Again, Dennis wrote a nice script to start four Yuriko nodes with uh, four miners, one each, based on the MIR framework. So now let's have it all run. It takes a little bit of time. So here we have it, it's initializing. We have, what is displayed here are two Yuriko demons and two Yuriko miners, and two more of each are running in the background. Now we see that messages are being submit, uh, are being uh, sent around and uh, we can, for example, in node one, which I already prepared a terminal for, 
we can uh, list the wallet the nonce is zero because there's no messages applied yet so i can copy the address of the node and uh, say Yuriko send to this address one file coin I made a mistake send so the transaction went through and now when I list the wallet again I might need to wait a little bit I know I list the wallet the message went through I already sent this uh, one file coin to myself now what I can do I can go and let's say I kill node one I kill both the miner and uh, the demon now if I want to list the wallet I get an error because the node is dead but I can go to node zero and I can do the same thing I list the wallet And I can uh, try to send some money to myself. Send to this address. Copy. Paste. One file coin. So the transaction went, uh, the transaction is submitted. And now I list the wallet. Now it takes a little bit more time, maybe. And the transaction went through, I send the money to myself, and the nonce is one. That's how I see how it works. So that's it for now. That uh, was uh, Mir and its uh, crash fault tolerance with four nodes and one being crashed. And uh, hopefully more updates will follow soon. Thank you very much.